was absolute. He let the spotlight shine, and his holy attributes stretch the finite mind. Who is, who is like him? There is none. We try and hold it three and one. But when all is said and done, God is amazing, amazing. His power cannot be compared. Exhaustive knowledge none can share. At all times, everywhere, God is amazing, amazing. Infinite, universal, self-evident This prince is the newest purple Rain suspended and glistening in beauty circles Uninhibited through a spirit A new reversal, no rehearsal Yeah, it's a paradox But God's omnipotence isn't hidden behind a mega rock But he couldn't lift These critics better stop New internal physics exhibits He made the petawatt This sun's energy atoms within a laser Adam needed an angle Jesus became the center plot now that could be geometrically a cinema, the card of the mill, emphasis on the metaphor. A metaphor, you get the picture, but consider the depiction of his power. Is it fiction? Does it take prophetic vision or religion to envision? Philosophical figure, the speculative definition. Nah, he's God anyway. We'll never break his code to regenerate, then create in the face of death. Incomprehensive race, meditate, venerate. This deity speaking degrees centigrade. Now that's cold, ain't it? Better than Joe Namath. God delivers on his promise. You could quote Jacob, omnipotence, omnibenevolence, power, preeminence, bow to his excellence. Who is, who is like him? There is none. We try and hold it three and one. But when all is said and done, God is amazing, amazing. His power cannot be compared. Exhaustive knowledge none can share. At all times, everywhere, God is amazing, amazing. Understanding that fasting the sun to vanish and fashion the other planets, imagine it from his vantage. Inhabitants under famines, having a stomach famished, he's not missing. If it's happening, it was managed with God's vision. His non ending cognition called omniscience is harassing the underhanded. He sees into the plight of you of each conscience and reads into the mind for rules in each thought. When even dudes that lie, then move to keep cautious. He to ruthless crimes they do, then he hearkens. Peeking through the blinds of fools and departments where evil doers hide and gloom and deep darkness he knows the future we see the point in certain sense all things happen by his pre-appointed purposes even on the earth was his knowledge so impassable we see jesus knowing both the possible and actual whether boasting in sin or holding it in he'll expose in the end cause hearts are open to him this theme's addressed in god's word observe proverbs 15 11 though he knows innocence the vast and the minutia he chose an affliction that evidence true love witness our missions wrath fell on his true son being Crush the sins, past, present, and future. Future, 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 future. There is none. We try and hold it three and one. But when all is said and done, God is amazing, amazing. His power cannot be compared. Exhaustive knowledge none can share. At all times, everywhere, God is amazing, amazing. Real treasure and worth. Answer, the Lord who fills heaven and earth. God in his essence is infinite, transcendent, unlimited, exhibited in omnipresence. All things before his eyes are laid bare as he governs the earth and skies with great care. There's not one sector or section that's undetected or left unaffected by his perfection. So I don't even need to smell the marijuana stench to know my God is deeper than the Mariana Trench. The calculation is 36,000 feet below sea level, about seven miles deep. 
If you got to the bottom without imploding from the weight, uh -huh. God would be waiting there saying, yo, yo man, man, you're late. <laughs> In the farthest galaxies, my God has the glory. Yeah. Cause distance for God is a non-category. Amazingly, God is able to be in Haiti and Greece, Jamaica and Sweden, Barbados, New Zealand, Lithuania, Egypt, Malaysia, Tunisia, and the Arabian Sea simultaneously. Yeah. Before him, everything is naked and exposed. That means there will be no escape before his foes. God's presence and his wrath will torment the sinner in hell. But those who trust Christ with them, he will dwell forever. Forever, 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 forever.